Welcome everyone. So today we are going to understand how to find the value of this question mark in this particular sum. So now your first understand whenever you have a grid problem what we try to do is we try to take total horizontally and vertically. So we have 6 plus 2 plus 2 that gets you to uh, 10. Here we have 8 plus 3 plus 2 that gets you 13. So this is definitely not working. There is not a common total. And here also if you see the total over here is what 6. Here the total is coming out to be way beyond 6 which is what 6 plus 8 gets you 14 plus this one 7 that gets you 21. So obviously this is also not working. So when you have the totals not working either vertically or horizontally then we will try to find some solution in the given working numbers. Okay. So over here when you have 6 and you subtract 2 square from this or 2 into 2. Let's not do 2 square. I think that will also get us wrong. So, we'll do six, eight, 2 into 2. We will get the answer as 2. Similarly, 8 minus 3 into 2 that gets you 2. So, basically what you're doing, you are subtracting the second number from the first number. But the double of the second number. Okay. So, we'll have 7 minus 2 into 1. Or rather, we have the number as 1 into 2. That gets you 7 minus 2. So answer for your question mark comes out to be 5. I hope this is very very clear to everyone. That's it for today. I will see you in the next video.